What's up guys? Spartan 85 here. Welcome to day five. It is the horde day, horde night of this series. <clears throat> if you did last series I did horde every five nights. I had some questions like why is there a horde on day five? Well on the PC you can customize the horde nights, so we're doing five every five days on this series. I already collected the water out of the dew collector. I I made another farm plot and I planted a pumpkin seed there. I had enough rotten flesh and clay soil. I also crafted the forge, you guys saw that. I got that down, it's smelting out clay, iron, and brass right now. Got that going right now. Made a whole bunch of food last night. There's the water, goldenrod teas. Let's drink one of those goldenrod teas real quick. And we're pretty much ready to go. I know I still have this broken limb that's recovering, so I need to kind of take it easy on that. And I got some people beating on some stuff. Sounds like quite a bit. There's Mo down there. Let's see if we take care of Mo. I did kill Harry outside the base last night, and I got the, fi oh, the Kill 50 Zombies quest done. There's Mo. He's the first of the 75. Let's go see what's crack a lacking down here. Sounds like a lot. Have I searched that? I haven't searched that yet. Uh, we'll take the cloth. There is everybody. Oh, some right here. You guys are going the hard way. The very hard way. I, this base is working out great, though. I mean, they have a lot of sh trouble getting up to me, so I like it. I might just be able to hit them with the sledge, honestly. Yep, there we go. Dead. Got somebody here. Got Lois, as I call her. All right. Are all taken care of. Kind of walking slow, just kind of dealing with this injury, though. So just bear with me. I'd rather get it healed before the Horde Night than have to deal with something, something else. Speaking of that, let's run over to the Horde base. Probably need to grab some supplies real quick. So let's do that real quick. We'll go get some forged iron crafting out while we got it. By the way, we can uh, make some iron doors and some iron uh, supplies and stuff like that. Oh, that didn't help. There's a boar. Do they attack you just out of nowhere? Like, do they... Will they charge you? I don't know that they will or not. I'm going to leave them alone, though, because I, I, I can't run or anything like that from them. So, uh, you going to be a nice boy? Yes? Okay, nice. Okay, I can make an iron hatch. Let's do that. I can only make one with the, the forged iron that I have, but I'll upgrade this hatch. I'm not going to worry about the door so much. Now, I do have uh, a little bit of concrete mix on me. Not much. So let's um, let's upgrade this to concrete. This to concrete. Those are the ones I really want. And let's do this one to concrete, too. All of those. Then once we get the, the hatch done, we'll upgrade that to iron. Now, I'd kind of like to funnel them. If I, I only have 16 zombies set up right now, but I'd kind of like to funnel them a little bit if I can. Meaning, like, I want them to kind of walk on the edge here. Like, I'm going to have to, I'm going to have to come up and walk on the edge, but I want them to walk on the edge too. Just so they, it kind of keeps them from getting bottlenecked, basically. So, we're going to do something like this. Like that. Nothing major, just enough to keep them from getting bottlenecked. So if they do get bottlenecked, they're going to fall down. So just stack that, and uh, and then we'll build this up just a little bit. Like that. And we'll go up here, and we'll build some more up here. Yeah, we're gonna use the dual and hatching 
I, I learned my lesson with my last Alpha 21 series. We're gonna use we're gonna use dual hatches. So that way we can get in and out if we if we have to. So this one right here, um, I might have really screwed this up. I might take these out and reverse. Um, this one will be a dual hatch, I think. Let's take these out. I'd rather have a hatch there in the middle. So let's take this one out here. There we go. I'd rather have it face like that. And then this one, um, I don't think I can make that one face on the inside. Let me see if I can rearrange this one. Unfortunately, with the way the hatches are facing, we're not going to have a dual hatch here, but that's fine. We'll put this one here. That's going to be like our fallback. I mean, look how I need to probably put some. I'm worried about putting too many frames here, honestly, is what I'm kind of worried about. So let's upgrade this to cobblestone rocks. They don't see this as a way to come. Worry about this. This is only held up by two pillars, so I really need to be careful about... Um, Yep, I'm out of cobblestone rocks now. So I don't know that this, if I put another row here, is this thing gonna fall? I really don't know. Let me just try it. I feel like this is a lot. That's why I'm trying to be a little conservative about, let's extend the roof a little bit. This is for birds here. They can still come at me from the sides and everything, but that's okay. We kind of see the city pretty well up here. Look at this. There's our job over there. We'll try to knock that out today. All right. Well, this is our kind of our. So my theory is these two hatches here will do our melee damage here, and look where they're gonna fall. I mean, they're all gonna fall off. They're gonna get. They're gonna. I mean, they're gonna all gonna die, and they're gonna pile up here, and they're gonna fall off. Hopefully, uh, I should take this block out here. I don't want them stacking up here. Let's take this block out. Yeah, I don't want them stacking up here. Yeah, make them fall off there, too. Any place we can have them fall off and get more damage is what we want. So I think this will work. Now, I don't have a, a fallback. I do not have a fallback at all. So, oh, let's let's test this. We got, we got zombies. Let's test it out. Let's see what they do. All right, we got two of them. Let's let them in. Whoop. Ow! Right on my... Oh, I fell! <laughs> oh, this broke my leg again! Oh, no. This is not good. And I got a lot of zombies coming over, I think. Where are they? Oh, this is not good. They deal with him first. Oh, my God. I got an abrasion now? They're in here just destroying stuff. I mean, like idiots. Let me close that door. I'll lead them back down and then lead them back up. That's what I'll do. Come on. Come on. Yeah, you're moving faster than me because I got a broken leg. Okay. We'll lead her up. I'm having to run, which is hurting my broken leg even more. Okay, yeah, you sit down. I'm going, I'm going. Let's not fall this time. Oh, I'm... Alright. This may not work. I might need something different. If I can't do this. 48 health. Um, yeah, I might need something different up there. If I'm going to keep falling. Alright, I'm going to leave them up there. I'm going to go heal myself. Like an idiot. <laughs> and we need to figure something else out for that. I guess I'll put maybe... Oh, man, I was hoping to use that for my advantage, but if I, I'm going to keep falling. That's definitely not an advantage. But this is why we do this. This is why we test this during the day. We test it with a couple zombies, we find the flaws, and we deal with it. So we have another plaster cast. Let's just use that. It's, uh, 24 minutes on the break. Oh, man. That really sucks. Let me eat some food real quick to help me heal. We'll eat some of this uh, grilled corn. But like I said, this is why we test, because this would have been in the middle of the horde night. Um, so this is why we test. Okay, she's a goner. Do we still have Harry up here? Harry, 
I'd love the test, but... Oh, crap! Okay, I got Harold. Let's try this one more time. Come up a little slowly. There we go. We did it that time. Let's go up. Careful here. Do not fall from this. Is he coming? Oh, see, now he's stuck on those. He's stuck. Which is not a bad thing. He's not trying anything different. Which is good. If we can get him to pile up right there, we can, uh... Man, I'd love to have some Molotovs or something. Well, I'd say the pathing is going to be fine. Um, these are going to be a problem, though, down here. So maybe I'll take out one of them. Let me go down here. Oh, big boy. I hear you. Big boy. Yeah, make that car blow up, big boy. He's a goner. I just got to take this slow, I guess. I got to take this really slow. I wanted to see if maybe I could put a frame down here, maybe. But it doesn't look like I will be able to. I just got to take this slow, guys. And they're already destroying this. See, they're destroying... The... Let me... Okay, I, I would feel better about taking this block out then. I don't want them hitting the ladder. If the ladder's gone, they don't have a way to, way to make it up here. So let's take that out. We're still going to have them have to go along the edge. Which is going to hopefully make them fall if they do get bottlenecked. So, okay. I think we're good. I think the horde base is good. I, I really do. Um, we need to put our iron hatch here. This is our first... This will be our first fighting here. This will be our first kind of level of fighting. I'm not going to put the pillar... I might put the pillars up. Uh... I'll put a pillar up here. What I mean by pillar is you should go here, shape, grab up. Uh, it's actually a pole. I'm sorry. Go pole, go to advance. And this keeps the crawlers from being able to come in, basically. Because all this does. Uh, I got somebody coming. Nope. How'd she get stuck in the... How'd she get stuck there? Weird. All right, whatever. I gotta redo this now. Right there. Basically what that does is keeps them from being able to crawl through when you close this. Now you're gonna have to duck, of course, to get through, but... Okay, let's go, uh, let's go knock out a job real quick. We'll do that. We'll go say hi to the trader. And, uh, maybe we'll have enough time to knock out a second job, possibly. We can maybe take on a tier one, maybe. Uh, maybe not a tier two, but let's go. Let's go knock this out real quick. Oh, I'm dropping frames like crazy. I have a feral on my butt. As you can see, everything got really blurry there for a minute. Sometimes it'll reset though, pretty quick. So let's deal with the feral. Dropping frames in the city. Any other ferals? Uh, he's not quite a feral, is he? Nope, he's not. Alright, I'm starting to regain some frames. If it gets real bad, I just reset it. You can see some kind of... Once in a while you have like a glitch or something like that. But yeah, sometimes we drop frames. Just gotta let it... Give it a minute, let it catch up. This is a big city. This is still not an optimized game. Rifle crafting. Cool. Uh, workstation crafting, and uh, re remove 20% more arrows and bolts from your enemies. Nice. That's a good one. Good one to have. More paper. And the job is... Oh, I thought this was the job here. Okay, we gotta go down here. Here we go! We're down here. There's a poppin' pills right there. This is the daycare place, I think, up front. I didn't really look at it too close. There's a deer... Workstation crafting. We can make the workbench. Yes, we need that. Paper. Ah, the frame's finally caught up. All right. Looks a lot better now. Shotguns have 20% less degradation. 
And I forgot to bring the uh, stuff to sell the trader like an idiot. That's okay. There's not much. Medical crafting. All right, let's uh, fire up this job. Oh, another lockpick. Nice. Play soil. Yeah, this is the daycare. Okay. Yeah, somebody. Else. Oh, she's feral. Oh yeah. Oh, uh, she's very feral. Trying to conserve some ammo. Ah. Yeah, I got 87 rounds. A lot more ferals in the in the in the city here. A lot more. Oh, we got another one coming over. All right, Skinny Pete's dead. All right, he's a goner. Man, another one. You guys just like to go this way, don't you? Not, not a bad little horde idea right here. Skinny Pete would just hold still. Oh my god. Come on. All right, shoot him in the chest. Oh, one shot. Still was a headshot. All right. That's enough of that. What do we got? Tough guy sunglasses. Gives you plus one fortitude. I think we already have the lucky goggles on. Yeah, which I prefer the lucky goggles. So we'll just sell those. I'll uh, we'll pick up the plants for the clay soil. Most of I missed again. All right. I like it. I was about to say it was kind of quiet in here. I was walking around for a minute. That's locked. There's a vending machine here, though. We can buy... Uh, not much. Not much at all. I will buy a Yucca Juice smoothie, though, because it helps with food and water. It actually gives you quite a bit of health, too. It gives you... Uh, it gives you 11 health. A little bit of stamina, too. Why not? There is improved fitting mod schematic, right? Cool. Some nails. Grab this plant back here. Let's scrap the ones that we do have. We got a couple. Cool. Got some stone. This is kind of one of those like if you don't break in, you're not gonna be able to search. This is kind of one of those like hit. Not you know just one of those rooms that you're not gonna just see. Is that a working stiff coffee maker? I guess I've never seen that before. I don't need the coffee. Screw that. Hole. Cool. Food back here. We'll eat all the food. And improves food crafting skill. And now we can do boiled meat and yucca juice. Nice. A bunch of them outside. Anything up here? I don't see anything. I also hurt myself several times just jumping. The act of jumping hurts so much. What is this, an elevator? Interesting. Okay. Uh, another college jacket. We'll sell that. It sells for 70. It's nice. Moe's falling down. Harry, you don't belong in daycares. Is Moe dead? Oh, more are coming down. Pretty sure Harry and uh, Skinny Peter are banned from 100 feet of schools and daycares, aren't they? Mo, I don't know. He's just ugly. Oh! Hey! Skinny Pete got pissed. I was talking trash on him. Goodness! That shuts. Okay, that's interesting. Keep that in mind next time they fall. Need like a breather. Rotten flesh. Search the spot on one? Yeah, I can't. Okay. A little bit of iron. Cool. Alright, looks like up is the way. I guess here. Gotta climb through this uh, ceiling, I guess. And then drop down here or there. 
I'm just gonna drop down here. I don't see any zombies, but... I guess I could have dropped into the bathroom, though. Uh, robots and stumpatons decrade 20% slow, slower. I'd, I'd love to get a stumpaton crafted pretty soon. There's the weighted head mod schematic. I'd like to make one of those. Improves robotic crafting. Dead. One more. He's dead too. All right. We got some more books over here to search. Some paper. All right. Another bookshelf too. Nice. And that's the armor plating mod schematic. Nice. More books in here. Blueberry seed. We'll gladly take that. Plant that bad boy. Bow crafting. Nice. Let's scrap these uh, plants that we have. And sledgehammer crafting. We can make the sledgehammer quality four now. I don't think I have enough supplies on me to make that. I have the stone. I just need the plant fibers. And shotgun crafting. We can make pipe shotgun quality three. Do I have... I don't think I have any pipes on me. I don't think I have enough glue and duct tape. I need glue, not duct tape. So I need to... Getting the water filter going, the water dew collector going is going to be nice because I can now start to use my murky water to make glue. Oh, there's a bird chilling out. Oh, too low. Got that one. Somebody's sitting down right here. That was too high. That was too low. That was just right. Oh, I have four skill points to burn, too. What am I doing? Need to use those. Any other birds up here? There's something. Oh, that's trash. We got Mosev laying down. He's dead. I don't know what that is. That's a Is that a dog? It is. I thought it was. Oh, oh, poor puppers. I'm sorry. I hate hurting puppers, even if they're ugly like that. I'm guessing the reason they made them so ugly with, like, one of the updates. Ooh, can I make anything with this? No, I can't. Because they used to, I mean, they, they've always been ugly, but um, they made them uglier with one of the updates. It's just because people don't want to hurt dogs. I don't want to hurt a dog. I hate that. Um, I'll take the cobblestone rocks and the nails, and I'll leave the goldenrod seed. That's fine. And I did not grab the fetch. I need to go grab the fetch still, too. It's somewhere down there. I think it's in one of the locked rooms, I think. Four bites and a first aid kit. I actually need to burn that first aid kit. I am hurting so bad. Uh, we'll scrap the crossbow bolts. Radiated Weapon Zombies. Read this quest note and accept the challenge to find and eliminate 100 radiated zombies with weapons. Find them in the wasteland and during the Horde Night. There's no restriction on your weapon. Well, let's just read that now. Because we just gotta find them. We just gotta kill 100 radiated weapons. Uh, bats and clubs just degrade 20% slower. There's the weighted head mod I was talking about. We'll sell the knuckle wraps. So let's sell the weighted head mod on our sledge. We need to make a new one. Um, I already have the ergonomic grip, so we'll th we'll put that on the new one because we should have two slots available. Sounds like Beavis and Butthead. We're gonna get, we're gonna go to Vegas and see some slots. <laughs> um, Beavis and Butthead do America. If you haven't watched that, go watch it. Tell your parents you're doing homework. You'll thank me later. Proves shotgun crafting. Twenty five percent more damage against dirt. Proves sledgehammer crafting skill. Nice. And some food. We'll just eat. All right. Scrap this chair. I gotta go find the stupid uh, what you call it? Um. Yeah, the fetch. Is it? 
It's like right below me. Can I just drop through the skylight here? Oh, I don't want to do that. That falls all the way down. <laughs> we don't want to do that. Let's go find this thing. There it is. Had to climb a ladder to get it. There we go. Nice. Did I make this drop right here? I hurt myself too bad. That wasn't too bad, was it? Oh, boy's breaking in here. Oh, he did break in. Oh, I'm not ready either. All down. Loot bag. Nice. I Man, my frames are trying to catch up. Oh, that's... Yeah, that's... Is that a wandering horde? I really don't know what that is. Uh, and I'm trying to walk somewhat slow. All right, we'll deal with them. I'm wondering if it's a wandering horde outside, because my frames just dropped. God! Oh, two loot bags. Uh, electrical skill crafting. We'll eat the food. We'll take the roids. Uh, scrap that. Eat the food. Take everything else. Okay. What up, Wrecked? I'm hobbling along, man. I'm moving slow. I'm trying to let this thing heal so I don't, it's not going on during Horde Night. Iron pickaxe, ranger's guide, baseball bat, forge steel, graveyard mod. Oh, man. I'm probably just going to go the iron pickaxe. Kind of, kind of lousy rewards, but I'll take that one. Let's go the clear zombies 356 next. Alright, I know I've said a couple times that I'm not going to make the coffees. I will buy the coffee. I'll buy the two Mega Crushes. Uh, let's buy a Grandpa's Learning Elixir. Let's buy... Let's buy a Black Strap. Why not? Um, Just thinking about tonight. You know, I have stuff for tonight. Basically all I'm doing. Uh, sugar Butts, Eye Candy. Oh, I didn't use that Eye Candy. Did I? Dang it. Oh well. Okay. That'll help us with our stamina tonight, because we're going to be trying to do a lot of melee tonight. So, I need to craft a new... Um, I can't grab this plant fiber, probably, can I? Yep, I can't. Okay. I need to grab some plant fiber to make a new... Um, Whatchamahootzer? Um, sledgehammer. So, we'll do that real quick. Over here. Got somebody coming. What's up, girl? Oh, yeah, she went through the world. That's my favorite. Okay, let's go weapons and make a new sledgehammer. It'll be level four. So we'll bring this up. We will modify. Take out the weighted head mod. And we're going to put the weighted head mod and the ergonomic grip on the new one. Nice. That's going to be even better. All right, and we got 15 seconds left of this um, thing, this injury. We'll be able to sprint back. I'm going to get prepped for the horde, I think. Uh, there's no sense doing anything else, because I'd rather be prepared. I'm a prepper. This is Prepocalypse, you know? So you got to be prepared. And uh, actually, I totally forgot that I have this uh, robotic sledge. I totally forgot. So let's bring that down. I actually will put a block here. And I'll probably have to put another block over here. Let me see if I can do this without breaking my breaking my bones here. Oh, uh, come on. That'll work. That'll work right there. I used the wrong block, so I'm going to have to take these out. This will allow me to put it right... Oh, can I put it here? Well, let me... Yeah, right there. That's perfect. So they're going to be getting hit into each other. <laughs> As they're trying to come up, they're going to be getting hit. Oh, this is going to be great. This is going to be great. I need to take this block out, though, right here. Let's take... That was just there to... Basically, for me to stand on. Alright, he's in place.
All right, here we go. Let's open the door. I did turn off dynamic resolution. It was on for some reason. I don't ever remember turning that on in video. I think that's going to help my video a little better. It's it's gunning for 60 frames a second. And it's hard to get that in this game. Usually run about... Oh, he's... Do that! That lumberjack has something in his hand! Look at that! He's got a freaking axe! No way! Oh, man, they're breaking through this. Oh, my God, they already broke through the... Oh, that's not good. Oh, they're coming through. Oh, this isn't good. This is probably where I die. Oh my god, they broke through already. Okay, this horde's gonna be nuts. This horde's gonna be nuts. Is it because he has the, the axe? Is that why they broke through so fast? Wow. Oh yeah, we're getting some work done now. Let me drink, uh, I need to drink, uh, something. Let's drink a coffee. Come on, let's go, let's go. Oh, Sledge is getting some work in. All right, man, they broke through fast, didn't they? I'm gonna use a, uh, bandage real quick. I want, does the Lumberjack do more damage to wood? Oh, that sucks. Oh, Harry got a hit on me. Well, this, if they're coming up one by one, like they're doing, the sledge is going to take care of them. Like that. He's got a freaking axe! Man, I'm also going to take this block out so I can see what's going on. I can't see what's going on. Um... Nice, got that one. Loot bags are stacking up. Ah, uh, I hear them coming. They're coming now. There we go. Getting some work in now. You can see the bodies flying over here. There he goes. <laughs> oh, oh, that sucks. They're definitely they're definitely going slow. And they're climbing up the ladders now. Oh, Skinny Pete fell. Climb up the ladders now. Let me close both these hatches real quick. Where they don't. Here they now they're stacking up. Oh, poor Harry. Poor old Harry. Now some of these might already have fall damage, so one one shot the arrow might take them out. I don't see anybody. Oh, there he goes. Oh. All the way down. She fell all the way down. I love this. I love this. I wish the sledge was hitting them that direction. So they get all the fall damage, but this is fine. They're beating on something. You got an arrow in your head. Alright. Let's drink a uh, Mega Crush. There she goes. I have five skill points to spend. There he goes. This is working out pretty good. This is working out pretty good. Oh, got another group coming. Oh, I keep missing the sledge takes them from me. That's okay though. I'd, I'd much rather just them get hit. I am hungry now too. So that's going to hurt my stamina a little bit. Decent group. Oh, Sledge is taking all the fun. Oh, there she goes. Oh. 
Oh, killed Harry with an arrow. There goes McLovin. There's body parts everywhere. There's a deer just walking around down there. <laughs> oh, this is great. Shoot them as they come up. Oh, she fell down. See, they're having trouble climbing the ladders a little bit. So that's even better. The more you can slow them down. I think next horde we will bump up. Oh, man, Harry. Oh, there he goes. Oh, that's great. That's great. I didn't think I'd be using the bow tonight. I had no idea. Killed the stripper that from that far. I don't know that I'm getting fall damage. I, I'm assuming you do. Dead. Well, here's a bow base for you for Alpha 21. If anybody wants to use a bow for Horde Knight, here you go. Perfect bow hook. Now, I only have 16 zombies. Like I said, I didn't know. I got overran pretty fast with just a simple hatch, but this is working out pretty good. Oh, he just fell down. Um, so I think next horde will increase to 24. We'll bump it up, and we'll just keep going up a little higher. We'll go to 32, then 64. I think that's it. Yeah, I think that's it. Oh, we got one more. We'll let him, we'll let him come up and get hit. There he goes. Oh! Oh! <laughs> He got up from that. He's going to come back for round two, looks like it. Got him. That's a headshot, too. Oh, wait a minute. Let's burn these skill points. We have five to burn. We have plenty to burn, so... We were going um, intellect. Can we go... We cannot go that yet. The looter one. The daring adventurer. All right, let's put another point in intellect. Now we can, the Daring Adventurer. All right. So let's go, uh, let's go Grease Monkey again. We already have the workbench unlocked, so I don't need to go any more advanced engineering. Let's go Better Barter. It's always a good one to go into. And I guess since we're using old robotic dude, let's go Robotics Inventor. Dude, why not? Robo Sledge. Ah, some food. We need that. Iron Arrows. Cool. Um, I guess I can just leave him up here. Why not? I mean, we're not going to need him right away. Where'd all the loot bags go? Did they fall down? Oh, I fell down. Oh, I did not get hurt from that. Okay. Wow. Kind of see what the damage they did. Did a little damage here. No damage down here. Um, I saw an arrow. Uh, let's check up here. They, oh, I see some damage here. Oh, they took out an entire block. Wow. Take this ladder out. Replace that real quick. Need to upgrade all this stuff, probably. Yeah, they did a little damage. Probably them all waiting in line, probably, is what it was. Just getting impatient. Yeah, they overran this fast. Oh, there's my mushrooms uh, growing. They overran this fast. Wow. Oh, uh, here's all my loot bags over here. Eat the food. Pick the ammo. And electrical crafting. Cool. Any other loot bags laying around down here? Nope. Nope. All right, that's a pretty good horde. I like that. It started off real bad. That lumberjack with the axe. Whoa. See, so that's a that's a mod specific zombie. That's a mod specific zombie. So are we are we level? Are we game stays hundred yet? Oh, I can't jump this. All of a sudden. There we go. Okay. Let me see what game stage we are. Here we go players. 
There we go, that's what I meant. Or at least game stage 19. So I thought game stage 100 is when you see higher zombies. I do have the one death. We have enemy kills 200. Okay. All right, I think that's going to do it, guys. I'm going to wrap it up, and I'll catch you guys in day six. See ya. Thank you.